how I look right now because I just got off work freaking outside and it's really hot today so like not a lot's going on today welcome back to my channel I decided last minute to do this little intro to my video because I was about to upload this video last night but decided not to because I felt like it was a little random my following has grown a lot since my injury so a lot of this really wouldn't make sense to people, so I figured I'd come on here and explain a little bit what this whole journey is about. So about three and a half years ago, I got really into yoga. I loved it. It's great for my anxiety. Besides that, it's just good for your body in general. I got pretty advanced. It was a lot of fun, and it was just a nice thing to challenge myself every day with. About a year and a half ago, almost two years, I broke my wrist. I broke my wrist right on this joint. Basically, the worst possible area, somebody like me who likes to be physically on their hands to break a bone because it's the central point of all my fingers. So of course, moving into my yoga practice, hands were a no-go. I couldn't do anything on my hands. Couldn't do a plank, definitely couldn't do a handstand. Moving forward, again, it's been about a year and a half. I still have issues with my hand. Like right now it's sore because, I don't know, I think I just did something a certain way today that irritated it. This is something I think I'm gonna live with for the rest of my life. When I went to the osteo surgeon, bone doctor, specialist, he told me, you're probably gonna have premature arthritis in this hand because of this. I think that's exactly what's going on. It is something you can work through. I know people who have had this issue, similar issues, worse issues, and they've moved through it, so I can do it too. And I think posting this journey on getting back into yoga will be a great motivator and just be something to keep me accountable for it because honestly the biggest issue I face with my yoga practice is frustration. My yoga practice is painful but I can deal with that. I can't deal with frustration. Frustration is one of my weakest points. When I'm frustrated I shut down and I don't want anything to do with what's frustrating me. I have pushed myself to stretching and keeping my flexibility and you know basic things that I can do but it's really hard. So that's kind of where I've been at mentally with yoga. So, long story short, my journey back into yoga. I started my YouTube channel just to post a yoga video that I made with my husband. That was one of the main things I thought I was gonna have on my channel, and it was for a little while, up until this happened. To go from being as advanced as I was to basically starting all over again, it's frustrating, it's annoying. It's like, I, I don't want to start over again. Why would I start over again? I, I know X, Y, and Z. Why do I have to go back to A, B, and C? Like, it sucks. But I'm going to do it. I'm going to get back to as advanced as I was. It's going to happen. And I figured, why not post it for you guys? Why not let you guys in on the frustration and the struggle? Because it's there, and I hate it. But I feel like acknowledging that that's how I feel right now is a big first Step. So I also want to go ahead and throw out there, this is not an informational video at all. I am not teaching you anything because I am learning myself. All I have is a couple tips and tricks that I've been given from fitness professionals on how to work with my injury and how to progress from my injury. But other than that, I'm not teaching you guys anything. So don't take this as an informational yoga how-to video because it's not. This is me working through a struggle and sharing that with you guys. I think. Working towards this is a big step because instead of what I normally do, shutting down and just ignoring it, I am addressing it. Through the frustration and through the shutting down, I just stopped working out altogether. I gained a little bit of weight, not a lot of weight. I wouldn't say I was fat, but I gained weight and I didn't like the way that I looked. I wasn't happy and I decided I was letting too many things in my life just bring me down and make me feel bad about myself and I'm done with that so I'm addressing each and every single one of those things in my life and I have been for the past couple months so this is me just addressing one more thing in my life that needs to be fixed so enjoy